I'm gonna be up front with you, right out the gate. I backed the wrong horse, I admit it. And I'm hoping we can put my fuck up in the past and work on setting things right for the future. You're a piece of dog shit, Sonny. You fucked me over. You have every right to be angry with me, but put yourself in my shoe. Garrett said he just wanted to talk to you, okay? So, I had to make a choice. I got my daughter to think about. Now, I don't like being on anyone's bad side, but I figured I'd avoid the bad side right there in front of me. At the time, it was the correct deal. Why should I let you live? Self-interest. We got this trade network, a mutually beneficial partnership. Now you can take me out, but my dead body is worth nothing to you. Alive, I could be the difference between you scrounging for crumbs and being the first one to eat. Your dead body is a guarantee if you lie to me again. Point taken. I know this probably doesn't mean much, but you have my word. I found a photo of you. Figured you might want it. A photo? What are you talking about? Damn, been a long time since I've seen this. Look at me, I'm a baby. You look stoned. <laughs> You're damn right, <laughs> never a sober moment back then. Thanks for this, tourist. I don't get too many trips down memory lane these days. I always ask myself, did it ever even happen? But stuff like this reminds me that there was a life before hell opened the floodgates. Hold on. I got something for you. It's an old guitar signed by Slim Dog himself. Just gathering dust around here. But I figured you can give it a proper home. Will the two of you shut up, please? I'm trying to sleep. Stuff something in your ears, then. All right. Let's get back on track here. I got some bad news. Father Carter's gone silent. Haven't heard from him in over a week. This could be catastrophic. I'm sure he's fine. The preacher is surrounded by zealots with guns all day, every day. I hope you're right. We lose the Padre, everything we busted our ass to build is gonna crumble. The exiles really trust the guy. Get over to the French Quarter and see what the hell is going on with him. Stick to the daylight when you go looking, will you? For safety's sake. And when you find him, if he's still breathing, set him straight. Lay some of that tourist charm on him. Whatever works, but we need to keep him in the fold. I am quite the charmer when I want to be. Make sure he understands his role in all this. That is not just about our takes, but helping the downtrodden. Blah, blah, blah. Stuff he likes to hear. I'll see you when you get back with some good news.
flock, my friends, they're gone. Butchered. Who did it? Mama came to me with the proposition. If I turned my back on my people, she would welcome me into her inner circle. The Chosen, she called it. Some nonsense like that. The fortunate few who would ride out the coming storm behind the safety of the tower walls. She said that my talents would be useful in the dark times ahead. Dark times? What's that about? She didn't elaborate. I railed at her with a rage I never knew was in me, spitting threats like a foul-mouthed brute. How dare she? I told her she would burn for her sins. How did she react? Mama said nothing. She just walked away. Two hours later, she returned in full force, slaughtered everyone. I ran and hid. In a hole. Like a filthy, despicable rat. Get it together, Padre. We need to talk. This is together. Good lord, my head. I'm swirling. I need more drink. I need to end this pain. Wait, you. You can help. Yeah, I'm trying to help you out here, Padre. Would you listen to me? For a second. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. A mother. I, I dropped her. Uh, speakeasy. But where? Where? God. God. My brain is useless. I'm finished. She's gone. Leave me. Let me rot. Not gonna happen. Sober your sorry ass up and put your business pants on. You made a deal, and you need to hold up your end. You are unrelenting, but so am I. You have my word, I will entertain your chat. But my mother, she must be with me. Take this. That gets you in. The soda machine in the alley. Clever. The speakeasy lies beyond it. She'll be in there. Somewhere. God, my infernal head won't stop spinning. My crucifix. Her ashes in there. So let me get this straight. All you need me to do is fetch a dinky fucking trinket for you and you'll get your head on straight? It's not just a trinket, tourist. To me, right now, it is everything. But yes, that is all I ask. Speak easy as hell, tourist. Incarnate. Infested. Would not take it lightly.
Expected. I saw you. I thought I saw you down the street among the dead. A mouthful of flesh. Sorry to disappoint. Guess I can't haunt your nightmares. Did you find her? Yep. Let me see. Her oh, mother. I can do this. With your help, I can do this. Not sure what's going on with you, but glad to help. I have one last favor to ask of you. Sure. What is it? My whole life was spent considering the needs of others. But now I must relieve my own burdens, and... And you... You were the person best suited to help me do so. Put me out of my misery. One bullet through the brain. Are you serious? You want me to kill you? You're a killer. What's one more death on your conscience? Sorry, but I'm not gonna play God. You need to decide your fate for yourself. Just fucking shoot me! May the Lord protect me and deliver me unto eternal life. Judging me. You. I can see. You. About time you got your ass here. Listen, we got ourselves another situation. Serious as a heart attack. We do, huh? It's Garrick. Dude's been crossing names off his shit list. And we're next.
Calm down. Garrick's a problem. That's established. It'll work itself out. Trust me. No, it won't. Garrick is the lunatic who cranked the bells for three days in Old Town. And according to my sources, he's coming for Bywater next. What's your plan? I know where Garrick's hiding out. You'd be surprised what intel you can get for a can of cream corn these days. Anyways, one of my contacts saw him coming and going out of the hotel and found an underground passage in the wine cellar. That should lead you to him. Appreciate the info. I've had enough of this guy. Thanks, tourists. You're the only one I know with the muscle to take him out. You get that firepower situation worked out yet? Grenade launcher. Enough said. All right, then. Warrior's cold. <laughs> I get it. Oh, shit. With all this Garrick chatter, I forgot to ask about the preacher. All this stress is killing my brain cells. I killed him. I gave him what he asked for. A quick death. Oh, shit. Really? Jesus. I didn't expect that. Doesn't matter, though, I guess. We probably never needed that bull-headed son of a bitch in the first place. Exiles are better off without them. The trade network will be just fine, just fine.